Hi, I'm Julie Uter. I'm the Dean of Continuing Education and Workforce Development at Garrett College. Students enrolled in continuing education and workforce development don't receive traditional credit, but many of the programs that we offer are eligible for an industry recognized certification, which is transferable regardless of where the student may live and work. In 2010, we opened the Career Technology Training Center, otherwise known as the CTTC, initially with our welding program. From there, we were able to work with the public schools and economic development to identify some other training programs that might be beneficial. My name is Carol Mowbray Brooks, and I am the Director for Adult Education and for all of our Workforce Development programs. Um, we offer several programs at the Career Technology Training Center. All of our classes are generally held in the evening or on weekends. One of our most established programs is welding. Uh, welding takes approximately 12 months to complete the entire training for students who have no prior training or have had no experience in that field. Our welding instructors uh, are currently working in the industries, uh, are very talented, and our students usually are very successful in passing the American Welding Society test. Our veterinary assistant training program is designed to prepare our students for an entry-level position working in a veterinary care hospital, emergency clinic, or animal care facility. This program can, can be completed by attending class two evenings a week, plus doing clinical experience at the student's convenience. Uh, in about four to six months, we have two very qualified instructors. One is a veterinary technician and the other one is a veterinarian. So it prepares the students uh, to have a really good overview of the whole veterinary field. The Certificate in Building and Apartment Maintenance Technician Program is one of our shortest programs. It allows students with no prior experience to complete a program in approximately four to five months that prepares them for an entry-level job, uh, servicing and maintaining many of our rental properties we have uh, at the lake, or apartment complexes or commercial buildings. Students have the opportunity to learn basics in plumbing, electrical, HVAC, appliance repair, and interior exterior maintenance. Hi, I'm Sue Fowler, one of the program directors for continuing education and workforce development, and the director for the certified nursing assistant program here at Garrett College. The CNA program is divided into two parts. The first is a theory section in which they learn their skills, practice on one another, and mannequins in the classroom setting. The second part, which is often their favorite, is going off for clinical rotation at one of the local nursing homes. Hi, I'm Doug Beitzel. I'm the program coordinator for the Advanced Life Support Training here at Garrett College. Uh, basically, we, we train paramedic level uh, students. They start out as an EMT and then after a year of being an EMT, then they come through our program and we train them uh, the more advanced stuff in the field. Paramedic is the highest level of training you can receive um, to ride on an ambulance. So uh, that's the uh, highest level of care that you can give. It includes IVs, intubation, drugs, that type of deal. Their college has been teaching paramedics uh, in Region 1, which is both Allegheny and Garrett County, for the last 20, 20 plus years. Uh, we've trained over 100 uh, paramedics and CRTs that are currently riding uh, the ambulances that uh, people are calling to their homes here in Allegheny and Garrett County. We also offer adult education programs to help our students uh, achieve various goals. All of our training at the CTTC and really throughout our workforce development programs include instruction on job readiness or employability skills because it's very clear that having these skills are equally as important as learning to weld or to be a machinist. We continue to work with employers to identify future training and programs, whether initial certification or professional development. Our ultimate goal is for our students to leave programs with industry-recognized credentials, which prepare them to enter or advance in the workforce.